Welcome to Design with Miyoshi. Uh, I have a little Revit project here, but you know, I forgot to, I haven't saved it yet. It's my first project, so uh, I'm going to do something beforehand. I'm going to go ahead and open up the GitHub desktop. And I'm going to go ahead and make a new repository, and I'll show you how to use this guy. I'll just do new repository. And this is a good spot for it. That's where I have my other repositories. So I'll just call this Revit 2021. And I will make a git ignore, even though I probably don't need one at this point. I'll just make it a C++ because I'm kind of used to that. I will make it later. And I like to use the MIT license. So I'll just put those in there. I'll create my repository. That's great, there's nothing exciting here. I'll just do publish repository. And I'm gonna keep it private. And it is just gonna go to GitHub. And this is um, the description for right now. This is gonna be Revit 2021 models and drawings. Okay, so I'll publish this repository and it's gonna do its thing. Now, one of the things I like to do, and you could do this on your repository as well, but I'm going to go, let's, kinda, let's go ahead and show in my Explorer. And see this Git Ignore? I'm going to right click on Git Ignore, and I'm going to go ahead and edit it. So I'm going to open it up, and I'm going to edit with Notepad, so I hit OK. And in my browser, I'm going to go to... Um, gitignore.io, and you can see I've gone here before. And I'm going to use Windows. I like to have a Windows. And I'm going to see if there's a Revit. I doubt it. There's no Revit. But I like to have a Windows um, gitignore get ignore that gets, it does, it saves, doesn't save a different Windows file. So I'll do a Create. And then I'll just do Control-A. Control C, and that copies these guys. And I'll do over here and get ignore. I'll do Control A, Control V, and there we go. And then I'll hit save. So file save. And then I can close this guy up. Notice now that there should be one change here on get ignore. So I'm going to do. I'll just say, I'll leave that there. I'll leave the message there, update git ignore. I'll commit to my name. And then I'll push this up to my GitHub. Now, if you go to GitHub, if I go to my own repository here, I will see that I should have a brand new repository here. So if I go to my repositories, hmm, what's on? I have my Revit 2021 and I can see my git ignore is now a Windows. So I can do that. I'll leave that alone. And as I put files in here, it'll be there. So now what I want to do in what I want to do in Revit is when I save this, I want to make sure I save it in that repository. Because I just want to save everything in my repository. I'll do save. And notice it's trying to put me in documents. Well, I don't want to go in documents. So let's go to where I want to be. And here's my repos. And here's my rivet. And there it is. So I will put this as, I'm just going to call it Kevin tutorial. And I'll just save that guy there. And there I have it. So once I've done that, um, when I'm ready, I'll look here and I'll, I can see my cabin tutorial in Revit. I can go ahead and commit that, but I'm not going to quite do that quite yet. Actually, let's do that. So there's my cabin tutorial. I'll commit it to main and then I'll push the origin and that gets it up to GitHub. And once I do that, everything is beautiful. Thanks for tuning in.
We'll see you next time on Design with Miyoshi.